This is a quite simple system to, uh, to test and to uh, advise swimmers uh, to make a better technique. It's a technique, their technical skills. And it includes that we are analyzing all the starts and all the turns and all the swimming styles. So swimmer uh, perform his start and turn style. We film with the four cameras, different angles, uh, and then we will analyze that in the computer with a special software. But the basic uh, approach is that I have a lot of experience. I have done then about 30 or more years of the world best swimmers. So then uh, the advice is what I give to them is according to the level what we need now in the high level swimming performance. So then tomorrow will be the analysis and showing uh, in the computer screen all the details what they should correct for the next time. And so it's on, I have done in many countries and I'm happy finally to be here, my neighbors uh, in Latvia. What can you say about Latvian swimmers? Uh, when you look at the, all the world's best swimmers, uh, the big difference? Yeah, of course in the result we have a difference, but uh, technically as I saw today and as I saw in the competition also, in my opinion technically they are not so bad. So the basic skills and basic uh, these uh, knowledge is what coaches have, they, they already apply to the swimmers. But uh, nowadays it's not enough, we should work with uh, very small details. And that's why I'm here to advise the smaller details. Maybe, maybe the problems uh, to, uh, to rise the higher level in Latvian swimming is uh, maybe more in the physiological preparation, all the endurance problems, all the maybe some organizing problems, managing problems, uh, this. But technically I can say that they are not so bad as you think. Uh, what can you say, what's, what's the secret of the American team? But why are they so so highest level? Yeah, look, uh, look, American team is a big complex. So then they have a lot of uh, uh, management uh, skills, and they are running that year by year. And we cannot compare small countries like Estonia, Latvia to America. But uh, anyway, um, uh, their their success based on the very systematic and very good uh, and the high level work in all fields, technical fields, physiological, psychological fields all the uh, selection systems and testing systems uh, look uh, some kind of uh, different quality testing of athletes they are very expensive and they based on the high level university testing systems there are uh, the world famous professors involved so we don't have these uh, resources in our small countries to be in the olympic games in a final it's a big thing and it should go step by step. I can see that you had only the first step. Your one boy was last year in the European Juniors in the medal place, but it's only one step. There should be more steps in the European Real Championships, in the World Championship, in World Cup events. So the series of this uh, good success, and then you have chance to go uh, in the final and do something in the final. In other way, maybe you can get the final place, no? But you are there, tr troubles, and you have no experience how to fight in the final to the place. So I think um, if we are now planning maybe more um, successful to be in future, so we should think uh, not in London. We should think uh, Rio and uh, and further cases. Then the small group of Latvian swimmers could go step by step, but it should be system. And also experience sharing with, uh, with uh, neighbors, with Americans, sending them some training ca camps and centers, and be internationally uh, involved in all, all training process, what is now very popular in European countries. They are not training alone at home. Not Sweden, not uh, Denmark, they are going international training camps they are sharing uh, uh, training camps and, and uh, this is the way now to be more open, not only, yeah. As, as we know in history, Germans are usually very close. They, they, don't, they want their secrets. That is not the, the way. Same, the same as in bobsleigh or skeleton. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. that, that is not the way of the success.
I have been exercised more than 20 years uh, uh, back uh, in history. I was involved in, uh, in the preparation of the Soviet Union national swimming team with all Olympic champions, world champions, good names. And then I worked uh, also uh, with a lot of European countries. Uh, uh, ten years I cooperate with Canadian swimmers and they had good success also. So now my best team where I cooperating is uh, Denmark. So Denmark made huge progress and uh, these Danish swimmers like uh, Lotte Fries, like Janet Ottesen, they are now in the top, but I start working and cooperating with them when they are juniors. Are about the, 10 years. Are there good swimmers in Estonia too? Yes, we have one or two good swimmers. They had medals in European Championship in December and we, we plan them to, to uh, take part in the London Olympic Games also. And of course everybody in Estonia is, have a benefit from my experiences, what I have abroad. So at home we do all the testing and filming and uh, seminars and I help the Estonian swimming the most. Okay, good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your job.